What's up, people? Welcome back to Freaky Nepal. My name is Dinesh. We are watching today the season finale of South Park season nine. I'm very too excited for this shit because a lot of you guys have told me that you can't wait for this episode. So now I can't wait for this episode. What's gonna happen in this? It's called Bloody Mary. The only thing that I know about Bloody Mary is that if you say it three times in front of the mirror, I think that's what it is. That you'll see a ghost or something, a ghost of Bloody Mary. So I have a mirror right here. I have a mirror behind me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Fucking hell, guys, it's fucking scary. I saw myself and it just, and I did not look good at all in the mirror. Fuck. The previous one was Free Will ZX and the ending was per fucking perfect. The ending, I love the ending. You can just see the whale on the moon, just dead. No music, no audio, nothing, just silence. That's what there is on, on the moon. Silence and death. That's what we saw. All the kids were fucking stupid in the previous episode. There's usually one kid who'll be like, no, no, no. Let's think logically, that shit cannot happen. Usually there's Kyle or uh, Stan. This time, none. This time all of them were fucking stupid, but I understand those are kids. So you, you, what, what do you expect, you know? Before we continue, if you're not subscribed to my channel, guys, what the heck are you doing? Hit subscribe. And if you want to watch the full length reaction video this episode and other movies and TV shows, the reaction that I do, head down to my Patreon. It's a wonderful way to support the channel, get early access to all of my South Park content and all of my other reaction content you can get over there. As soon as I record them, they go on Patreon the same day. And now without any further ado, let's jump right into this. Finale. Right, we're going to start this in three, two, one. <laughs> what? <laughs> Cartman, you're doing too much. I'm a little better than everyone else here. That's what you think. You must follow direction. Eric Sun. Rack of discipline. Fucking hell, Cartman, with the accent. Come from within. Through discipline, come from within. I will see you on Tuesday. Shut up. Oh. Dude, we gotta hurry home. The final episode of Lost is on soon. Yeah, let's go. Wait. Where's my dad? Where's Kenny? Oh, Kenny, he couldn't afford it, of course. Yeah? Dad! <laughs> he's, he's drunk. Hey, come great. on, I'll drive you boys home. Can Are you? Are you sure you're alright? Oh, yeah, I'll be fine. I got some beers to keep my buzz going. <laughs> 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 Fucking love, Randy. <laughs> dad, aren't you supposed to, like, not drink and drive? Fuck off. <laughs> I'm not drinking and driving, I'm driving while I'm drinking, right, boys? <laughs> Yeah, nope. whatever, dude. <laughs> as long as everybody's safe, you know. Let's just pull over. Stan, you need to learn some things about being a man. Give me that you get, bottle. You get drunk anytime you want? Is that the rule for being a man? Reason God made our penises like little hoses, boys. Hold the wheel, Stan. Oh, I was gonna, I was gonna say, what's he, what's he doing? Is he putting the bottle in his zipper to hold it like that? Because he had to drive, is he, might be, might be driving a stick? No, this fucker is pissing. When you boys start driving, you're gonna need to learn to do this too. Oh! Dad, we're gonna crash! Shh, I'm trying to concentrate. <laughs> Hold the damn wheel. Oh shit! Dude, I think you're being followed. By a cop. Get off my ass, dickhole! No, dude, it's the police. <laughs> oh shit. Oh crap. Fuck. Give cop that piss bottle. Give him the piss bottle. Everybody just stay calm. I can handle this, no problem. I know how to deal. <laughs> yes, a chewing gum would, would do the trick. What seems to be the officer problem? Yeah, he's fucking drunk, sure. okay? <laughs> what seemed to be the officer problem? <laughs> Sir, I'm going to give you a sobriety test. Okay, no problem. Easy. Stand over here, please. Dude, your pants are undone. I want you to hold your arms out at your sides. Can I yeah, do that? I did it, see? I did no it. No problem. And now touch your finger to your nose. Do what? Touch your finger to your nose. Come on, Randy, you can do this. I did it. And that's impossible. <laughs> Just bring one hand to your it's nose impossible. like this. <laughs> yeah, that, you gotta do this. Okay. Come on, Randy, you can do this. I, I'm rooting for you, Randy. Come on. Hey, hang, hang on. Maybe oh, not. Oh, okay. Oh, oh fuck. He, your butt's out now. Dude, what the hell is he doing? I think his pants are falling down. <laughs> it, it, it is. What? Well, he's what naked I do? now. What I do? What I do? Well, <laughs> you get into fights when you go to see kids league. And now, here you are, drunk driving. Oh, oh fuck. Jesus. This is so <coughs> embarrassing. You know, Stan, I'd say that your dad racks a discipline. <laughs> guys, I can't see vomit, okay? When I do it, just sometimes, sometimes it just hit me. Look, guys, about last night. 
Can you just keep quiet about it? Oh, he did. I, I think everybody knows. We're going to hear from a motivational speaker. Ooh. The state has sent over somebody to talk to you all about the dangers of drunk driving. <laughs> Please welcome Stan's dad. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. <laughs> Why did it say Stan's dad? Why not just Randy? You, you shouldn't drink because it leads to bad things. I was in jail for the night and, well, I guess, I don't know. I just don't drink. But yes, that's it. Just don't drink and drive, okay? Drink responsibly. Responsibility. Fucking shit. Dis drink responsibility. No. Drink responsibly. Responsibly. Okay. Fucking tell my English is going shit. If you don't make the right choices in life, you could end up being a big loser like Stan's dad. Why the fuck you gotta miss Stan's name? Oh, come on, Mr. Grayson. Mrs. Grayson, you're doing it on purpose now. Like Stan's dad, dude. Fuck off. I want you all to take a good look at Stan's dad and say, is that who I, I don't want to be in... Stan said <laughs> getting tickets and having to go to elementary school classrooms and talk about how pathetic I am Thank you, Mr. Fuck? Marsh. I think you made your point <laughs> You made the point but with the help of AA. I've been sober for 10 years now Ready like I have to be sober for 10 years what the fuck <laughs> and I'm really turning my life around No more blowing guys on Colfax Avenue for a pint of vodka for this cowboy <laughs> Is that well Depends upon the addiction, I think. But I think if you are blowing somebody for some addiction, usually it is some hard drug, maybe like meth, meth or cocaine or some shit. Who blows for a, for a vodka? If you are blowing somebody, even though you are not gay, for vodka, yeah, you should actually, you know, go to double A's. You should think about your life, what you're doing. Like if you are, if you are blowing somebody for meth, that's fine. <laughs> I mean, don't do meth. <laughs> I'm just saying, in context of blowing somebody to get something for your addiction, it has to be something really, really hard, not fucking vodka. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense to me. Don't do meth. <laughs> My name's Randy, and I just really like beer. Me too, Randy. I love beer. I you have to admit you're an alcoholic. No, the fuck off. I'm know if I'm really an alcoholic. <laughs> why are you here? Because you're drunk and drive? I was stupid one night and drank too much and then drove a car. That was dumb and I'm not going to do it again. Good. At least he knows about it. You are powerless to make that decision. The only thing that works is the 12-step program. Step one is admitting that you are powerless to control your drinking. <laughs> only then can you move on to the other 12. If it's just beer, though, well, you know... Y if you drink a lot of beer, you are drunk. But I don't like whiskey. I don't like rum or vodka. I would drink rum if the temperature is in uh, is below zero degrees uh, Celsius. Rum in that area is fucking holy water. Because <laughs> it really warms you from inside and you don't feel cold anymore. Other than that, I don't usually drink rum at all. I don't usually drink whiskey or vodka or any sort of alcohol. Unless it's a beer, because I, I like beer. If, if I'm in a party, I would actually just go for the beer, fuck the other alcohol and stuff. I don't like that. I used to drink whiskey a lot at one point in my life. And uh, I, st I, I, I loved it. <laughs> and I turned into somebody else. According to the people who were around me while I was turned into somebody else, I was fucking awesome. They loved hanging out around me. I was the fucking center of attraction and making jokes, dancing, and just smiling and laughing the whole fucking time i was it was awesome that's what everybody else say other than that i don't remember a single fucking thing that, that happened last night and i'd love to be in control of what's happening I, I should know what happened last night since that happened one day i was like okay no you know what fuck it i no more whiskey anymore so i don't just don't drink whiskey anymore you just have to admit that there is some kind of god which has power over you and turn your life over to that god and ask him for forgiveness that's the 12-step program not religion well, technically, it is. To cut down on my drinking and never drive the car drunk again. You can't just cut down on your drinking. You need to admit you're alcoholic. Something. You have a disease. <laughs> he drove. He drove while drunk. That's it. Alcoholism is a disease. You're sick, Randy. You're very, very sick. Now you're just planting this in his head. Now. You can't cure it yourself, and it's deadly. Also, does AA meetings, do they cost you? Do they charge you to go to AA meetings? I See, I don't know. 
I don't think we must have them over here too, but I don't know. Let me know, guys, if if you know you have to pay to go to these meetings. If you do, well, you know why this guy wants to join, want Randy to join twelve step program because he wants the money. <laughs> Dad, what the hell are you doing? Getting drunk? What the? It's the middle of the day. I thought you weren't gonna drink as much anymore. It is oh, Dad, sickness. I don't understand. I you are sick. <laughs> Yes, they're the ones that told me. And now he believes it. I have to admit that I'm powerless to this terrible disease. <coughs> if you admit it, then you can drink more, of course. Rand is fucking genius. Stop now. I can't, I'm sick. <laughs> He's just like saying, I know, I know the problem, but because I know, that's, that's good. Disease. <laughs> disease. Just cut it down one by one, Randy. What the fuck are you doing? Why? Oh, what the fuck? It looks like his dad! Dan, I need your help. Where's your dad? If I don't give myself up to a higher power, this disease is gonna kill me dead. <sighs> the thing that will cure me is a miracle. <laughs> well, he, he has quit. You know, he right now has given up. He's like, fuck it, I don't care. Only a miracle can save me. I, I, I'm not gonna do it by myself. Not gonna put the effort at all. What the fuck is happening here? Is that Bloody Mary? The statue of the Virgin Mary has started to bleed out its ass. No, the was it was it in the, with the with, was it in the ass? I thought oh it is the ass. Fucking it. Mary's ass late last night. <laughs> People from <laughs> So, I'm just going to say guys, don't think it is an offense, it's just a joke. It's just a joke, but Virgin Mary isn't virgin anymore. <laughs> All over the state have That's when the, the blood's coming out of the apparent ass. miracle firsthand. <laughs> Why do you believe the Virgin Mary is dripping blood from her ass? It may represent her sorrow over all the bad things. All the pain in her ass. ass. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so sorry, guys. Okay? I'm just making jokes. <laughs> As news of the miracle spreads, hundreds are expected to show up here at the church, hoping to witness the miracle and even cure their diseases. Mm hmm. Oh shit, Randy, now you can go. Cure disease. Mm hmm. Stand! Look what AA did to Randy. He only drank a little, now he's drinking every time. The disease because it's a physical dependency. That yeah, that's what he believe it now. No, cancer is a disease. My dad needs to drink less. Yes. He can't quit by himself. None of us could. He needs to He buy. was quitting. Well, he didn't even quit. No, he just he didn't needs drink a drink all the time, but now he does. He thinks he has a disease that he can't cure himself. Young man, do you know anything about the 12 step program? Fuck your 12 step program. I don't know a thing or two about cults. I was the leader of one for a while. Yeah, he was. It was a couple of episodes ago. Scientology, yeah, that's what he was for. Miraculously cry blood out her ass. Thank you for letting us know again. Hillary has been sent by the Vatican to determine whether this is a true miracle or not. Yeah, what did the Pope say? The Pope's here! Pope, why the blood is coming out of her ass? What do you think? Don't just. Whatever you do, just don't taste the blood. Don't lick it. Do not lick it. Well, uh, he did not lick it, okay? <laughs> Mary just... Watching Mary just farted blood on Pope's face. What a wonderful sentence to say! <laughs> Do you think that's a period? <laughs> it's a miracle. Of course it's a miracle. The statue just farted blood on your face from the statue's ass. No, mm -hmm. Stan, you don't understand. There's a church in Bailey. The statue of the Virgin Mary is bleeding out her ass. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> Remember, if you get pulled over again, you're going to go to jail for 10 years. Wow, all right. All right. Stan, you drive. Then you drive. I'm eight. <laughs> this is my only hope, Stan. Ask your wife. Well. He is driving. Can't even see. He... Hey, Josh Garrett. How you doing? Oh, hey, Randy. What happened to you? Alcoholism. It's alcoholism. It's pretty serious. You? Well, my daughter has elephantitis. Oh. We are the same, she and I. No! Hey, what do you think you're doing, kid? 
you're trying to cut in line. I just, uh, my dad was... I would was... never cut the line. I, I can never face this sort of situation. It just, it just feels very weird to me. I'm too shy to cut the line. You're a butter. You're a dirty line cutter. <laughs> So what do you do? You lick the blood? I suppose. No, okay. Just make it. What's going on here? This kid's cutting in line. Please, officer, you have to understand. I need a miracle way more than these people. You, no, you don't. And I'm powerless over it. I understand. My, my brother's an alcoholic. Here, let me push you to is. the front of the line. Oh, shit. Well, well okay. Over. Good. Well, good for Randy, I suppose. Me, out of the way, please. Alcoholic coming through. <laughs> Oh. My god, oh, what the fuck? Are you killed? Do you want beer anymore? I'm not going to drink this. I'm not going to drink this! It's a miracle! I'm cured! <laughs> he stands like, what the fuck is. Why my father is so stupid? Mother, thank you! Thank you, God! He's still gonna drink, isn't he? Good no, morning. maybe not. I'm Randy, and I'm an alcoholic. Was uh, Randy? Randy, you could have said was. But I put my faith in a higher power, and I haven't had a drink for five days now. I mean, he—you got squirted by blood from Virgie's Mary ass. If—if if that doesn't make you not drink alcohol, I don't know what will. Oh, yeah, that is good. Oh, yeah. An incredible update from the bleeding Virgin Mary statue. It was all a hoax. It was all a hoax, isn't it? Here today, the new pope. Pope Benedict the 16th himself visited the statue here in Bailey to and? witness the miracle firsthand. And come on. Oh shit, the main pope is here. Benedict made his way through the throngs of people. Right this way, your holiness. The pope see, then examined the statue closely. What did he see? Come on, squad, some blood on his face too. Not him. Is it because he <laughs> Is it because he plays with little kids too much? That's why he's not getting blood on his face. He got blood on his face. There you go. After witnessing the phenomenon firsthand, the Pope then cleaned himself off and then declared that the bleeding Virgin Mary Come on, statue I, I'm, yeah. is not a miracle. What? Why? The Pope determined that the blood was not coming from the Virgin Mary's ass, but rather from her vagina. And the Pope said, quote, She's not watching anymore. Out her vagina is no miracle. Chicks bleed out their vaginas all the time. Pope, you Back savage! <laughs> Chicks bleeding out of vagina. A savage. <laughs> Fucking savage. She is a woman. Three shots of Macallan, two small bottles of vodka, three bottles of beer. Yeah, he was waiting for this. Let's go. Randy, what are you doing? You heard what he said. The higher power didn't cure me. I'm powerless again. No, you were I'm fine. Powerless too. Fucking hell, there you go. Pope ruined it all. Jack and Pop. Dad, Dad, stop. I'm sorry. You gotta talk some sense into him, Stan. Maybe, maybe I can force myself to never drink again. Don't say never. If you wanna drink, you can drink. Just no. Dad, you like to drink. So have a drink once in a while. Exactly. If you devote your whole life to completely avoiding something you like, then that thing still controls your life and, and you've never Fucking really hell, smart. At Where all? were you in the previous episode with this smartness? I'm just the kind of person who needs to have it all or nothing. Nah, all or nothing is easy. But learning to drink a little bit, responsibly, that's a discipline. Discipline <laughs> comes from within. <laughs> Why are you talking in accent all of a sudden? <laughs> Discipline, discipline, come from within. I've had a great teacher. Miss Mag, Miss Garrison? No, not you, my karate teacher. Oh, okay. Let's leave the car here, walk home, and watch the game. I'd like to have another beer or two. All right. All right. Come on. Or maybe I'll have three beers. Okay, you gotta Probably stop okay it now. You spread it out. <laughs> I think you're pushing it. Yes, not exactly. That's Fuck not discipline. Right, right. <laughs> discipline. Dad. No. Oh, that was a nice episode. Alrighty, people, so that was season finale of South Park season 9, Bloody Mary. And it was nothing about Bloody Mary with, you know, saying Bloody Mary to in the mirror, a ghost will haunt you. It was nothing like that. It was just, it was just Virgin Mary bleeding out of her ass. And at the end, Pope was like, she was not bleeding out of her ass. She was bleeding out of her vagina and all chicks 
who bleed out of the vagina are not special. It's bleeding out of a vagina is not a miracle. It's right about it. But at the same time, Pope, that's a fucking statue. How the fuck is it? It doesn't matter if it's an ass or if it's a vagina. Where the fuck is the blood coming from? And we all know Virgin Mary is not virgin anymore now because the blood's coming out of her vagina. And all, all this time, everybody thought it was her ass and not the vagina. How did Pope? I, th I thought that was the ass because how did the vagina came that up from the back? The, fuck it. I don't know. But... It was Pope who had to describe everybody. No, guys, this is not an ass. I know what an ass looks like because I sometimes do it with the kids. Ah, so this is not the ass. This is just vagina. It's all jokes, guys. I make jokes, okay? Don't take it too seriously. I can't believe I have to say that sometimes. At the end, Randy found that his son is right. I can just control that by myself. I don't have to drink that much. I don't have to think it as a disease and just forced to not quit because I think it as a disease and I, there's nothing I can do about it. It's at least then, you know, made him realize and show him some sense. That's good on him. Good son. That was this episode of South Park. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. If you did, please do leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And if you want to watch the full-length reaction video of this episode, other movies and TV shows reaction that I do, head down to my Patreon. I can watch season 10 already out on Patreon. That's been it for today, guys. Hope you guys have a great day. Stay away from Bloody Mary's ass. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.